On this episode, I'm going to show you uh, how to log it into um, the Wi-Fi network automatically as you boot your Tiny Core Linux. It isn't that difficult. Let me show you. First, you gotta go to uh, this folder called etc. Just type it in cd slash etc. Oh, oops, mistype. Well, you're there, and uh, type it in another folder, then you go to uh, opt, then you're at opt. And uh, I'm going to show you this one, WPA supplicant dot configuration file. And uh, when you come to uh, etc folder, this configuration file should be uh, somewhere around etc folder. But before you do that, you must log on to your Wi-Fi. And uh, this configuration file contains your Wi-Fi name of your Wi-Fi and the password and the security key for your uh, wireless router. So you just type it in, copy WPA supplicant and dot conf to OPT and press enter. Then it will appear right here and the uh, file here on etc will be erased automatically damn it's shaky uh, right uh, so like after you do that um, on next reboot it will be gone from etc so you don't have to worry about this folder right here and after you copy this thing right here you need to make this shell script called Wi-Fi dot shell. I mean, you can change names like any way you like, but I uh, named it this way. So like vi slash Wi-Fi dot shell and type in exactly as I wrote in here, these two lines. And uh, you don't really have to understand what this means, but it will load up like Wi-Fi, you know, like the password and whatever from the beginning of the, you know, the Tiny Core Linux startup. So like you just pass it this video and you copy it, all right? And you save it. When you want to save it, you just type WQ. But I already did that, so I'm going to just quit. And this is what you should have got to do. When you create this file, this file will stay in white color, which means it's not executable, right? So it's a shell script, so you must make it executable. So like chmod 777. Wi-Fi dot shell and press enter then this shell script will turn into a green color and uh, there is last step that you gotta do you gotta go into root just type in sudo su and you get to see this dollar sign turns into shop sign and you're in root mode right and type in vi boot sync dot shell right here boot sync dot shell right and you get to see like a bunch of things here but you don't have to know all of it last line you just add this one line right here and um, opt wi-fi shell and the design right here 
and without root you are unable to write anything on this file wq is signed right here and press enter but I already did that so I'm just gonna quit and you're all set to go you just uh, exit and backup reboot and you won't have to uh, click this button again for like next time so like I guess this that's it for today I hope this video helped you to uh, use Wi-Fi on Tiny Core in more convenient way anyway bye